Hello, this is Trog, and today I'm going to be showing you how to update your Skyblock 4.6 map from 1.14 to 1.15. So the newest update is Skyblock 7, I've got it right there, and we need to update our Skyblock tutorial world. So uh, if you haven't backed it up, click back up and load, and that's what I, I haven't backed it up, so I'm going to click that. And uh, your world will start loading, it'll make a backup, and uh, now you need to install the new version of the data pack. To get to your data packs folder, you want to hit Windows and R, and that'll bring up Run, or you can just search Run, it'll pop up, and you type in percent sign app data percent sign. Now you go to Minecraft, and you go to Saves right there, and find your save. So mine Skyblock Tutorial and click on Data Packs. So I already have the uh, the new data pack right there, and to get there, you can easily go to Planet Minecraft. There's a link in the description. So here it is. Uh, this is the data pack and updater. You just click Download, and that'll bring you to Mediafire. You can download the data pack there. So now what you want to do is delete the Skyblock data pack, and if you have other data packs, don't worry about it, just delete the one Skyblock data pack. Um, and now you want to right click on the zip file and extract extract here, sorry. Um, and now that that's done, you can delete that .zip file and go back into your Minecraft game. Okay, now that you have had the data pack installed, you can hit, es hit escape Go to open land and allow cheats. Start land world. Now, uh, turn yourself into spectator mode like that. You will be able to see the armor stands and that's kind of cool. But uh, you type in slash function skyblock uh, colon update and witch hut start. And that will teleport you out to where the witch hut is going to be for this update and uh, it'll be close to the world border, so you'll see that. Um, but now you need to save and quit the game, and we're going to be going to a different program. The program you will need is NBT Explorer right here. So uh, download link is in the description. Uh, you can double click on that, and uh, it will bring you to your saves file. So now you scroll down to your world, so again, Skyblock tutorial for me, go to region, open that up, and go to r-2.0.mca. And uh, this is pretty important. This is an important step. Otherwise, you can't get the uh, you can't get the witch hut. But you will be deleting the chunk 11,5 that one right there so uh, hit the X right there delete tag and then hit save and now you are done in NBT Explorer now you can rejoin your single-player world the one you're updating I promise you won't have to do anything outside of game from now on that was the last thing you needed but if you look down there's that chunk that we deleted and uh, the world automatically regenerated it for us so open to LAN, allow cheats again, and this time you want to type in function skyblock update witch hut clear. Uh, oh, oh, okay, I accidentally hit start, so uh, let's do clear. And that will get rid of all the blocks around it, and you will have a floating witch hut, just like uh, in the 4.07.1 map. So now to get back home, I suggest flying towards the world border. Um, so as you can see, there, there are the coordinates there in case your render distance is low. If we go into it, you'll see we get teleported pretty high up, but you will be around your normal skyblock base. Ooh, I've got some cows and pigs and stuff. Cool. So there is one more thing you need to do, and uh, that is over at this birch island over there but if you don't have it you can do it at your normal base that's completely fine but you go into creative mode and get yourself a bees nest uh, hot nest yes I, it's supposed to be a hive right isn't it a hive uh, anyway um, and then you spawn in three bees for yourself and that will give you everything that you need to update 
to the latest version as if you started on 4.07 to begin with. So that's it. I That's all I have for today. I hope you enjoyed. Next episode, we'll be doing an XP farm, so stay tuned for that.